Thank you for that, Ross. Tonight, city's leaders with Columbus are pushing back against an apparent Nazi group who showed up at a drag event today in Columbus. A drag brunch was scheduled to take place at Land Grant in Franklinton. And around that time, videos like these appeared online. They were chanting and holding flags with swastikas. Columbus City Council President Shannon Harder tweeted this, quote, LGBTQ plus kids and families shouldn't have to deal with obscene hate from literal Nazis. While Columbus Council has a budget existing in Mark for KYC Ohio, I'm donating today to support the great work they do and show that our community stands with KYC and the community they serve. KYC Ohio refers to Kaleidoscope Ohio, which supports members of the LGBTQ plus community. And the money raised at today's event was for that organization. Now, this isn't the first time that we've covered events like this. We've covered multiple in the past, including that protest of a drag story time last December. You may remember that event was canceled, but protesters still showed up in droves, including members of Patriot Front. In 2021, there were three documented events involving white supremacist groups. Last year, 15 gatherings were reported. A few months ago, we spoke with the Anti-Defamation League, and they told us there was a reason that these incidents need to be documented and reported. It's scary when we see a rise in hate. Um, but I think it's so important to recognize what's happening and name it, and then work together to fight against it. We'll, of course, keep you updated if anything develops from this.